5 Shocking Modern Pirate Stories When most people hear the term, pirate, they envision the romanticized 17th century era filled with daring adventures, sword duels, plank walking, and searches for hidden treasures. However, what remains unknown to many is that in recent times, there has been a resurgence of piracy on the high seas, quite different from the popular perception. These contemporary pirates engage in heinous acts and have gained notoriety for their atrocious crimes. In present times, piracy continues to thrive in various regions, notably the Indian Ocean, the Red Sea, off the coast of Somalia, and the Strait of Malacca. Armed with AK-47s and RPGs, these pirates utilize high-speed skiffs to capture large merchant ships, yachts, and other vessels, often taking hostages and demanding ransom. The severity of modern piracy is a pressing issue, resulting in the theft of millions of dollars worth of goods and numerous instances of murder and abduction every year. In this article, we will explore 10 of the most shocking cases of contemporary piracy. 1. The Vacation In 2011, four Americans embarked on a dream vacation, sailing the world on their yacht, The Quest. Tragically, their journey turned into a nightmare when Somali pirates hijacked their vessel, approximately 305 kilometers, 190 miles, off the coast of Oman. In response, the U.S. Navy deployed the aircraft carrier USS Enterprise and three other ships to intercept the pirates and rescue the hostages. Within a few days, the Navy squadron caught up with the quest, which the pirates were attempting to sail back to Somalia. In an effort to negotiate the release of the hostages, two pirates were taken aboard the guided missile destroyer USS Starrett. The Navy proposed letting the pirates take the yacht in exchange for the hostages' freedom, but the pirates rejected the offer hoping for a higher ransom for the captives. As negotiations stalled, one of the pirates on the quest fired a rocket-propelled grenade at the steric, fortunately missing the target. Shortly after, gunshots were heard from the quest, prompting the dispatch of a Navy SEAL team to reclaim the ship and secure the hostages. A brief confrontation ensued, resulting in the death of two pirates, one shot and the other killed with a knife. The remaining pirates surrendered, but unfortunately, all four hostages had been shot and did not survive. The team also found two other pirates' bodies, who had apparently been killed earlier under mysterious circumstances. To this day, the motives behind the pirates' decision to kill the hostages remain unclear. The quest incident serves as a grim reminder of the very real dangers posed by modern piracy. 2. The Maersk, Alabama the 2009 hijacking of the American crewed merchant ship Maersk, Alabama gained global attention and later inspired the movie, Captain Phillips. While crossing the Indian Ocean en route to the Kenyan port of Mombasa, the ship fell under attack by Somali pirates on a smaller speedboat. Despite the crew's efforts to defend the vessel, the pirates managed to board it. During the incident, the pirates captured Captain Richard Phillips but failed to apprehend most of the 21-man crew as many hit or secured themselves in a safe room. The resourceful crew promptly disabled the ship, preventing the pirates from gaining control. They also actively resisted, even taking one of the pirates hostage by ambushing him with a knife. Realizing they couldn't control the ship, the pirates abandoned it. However, three of them opted to escape on a lifeboat, taking Captain Phillips as a hostage in an attempt to reach the Somalian coast. The lifeboat came under the watchful eye of several U.S. Navy ships, which engaged in negotiations for the captain's release. After days of unsuccessful talks and a failed escape attempt by Phillips, Navy SEAL snipers aboard the USS Bainbridge took decisive action, simultaneously eliminating all three pirates. Captain Phillips was successfully rescued, and both he and his crew were hailed as heroes for their quick thinking and bravery during the harrowing ordeal. 3. The Nahan 3 In 2012, the Naham 3, a fishing vessel operating in the Indian Ocean, fell victim to an attack by Somali pirates and was subsequently captured. 
The crew, comprising 29 individuals from different Asian countries, including China, Vietnam, and the Philippines, faced a harrowing ordeal. They were transported to Somalia, where they were confined in the desert, while their captors demanded exorbitant ransoms for their safe release. During their captivity, the crew endured severe hardships, frequently subjected to beatings and resorting to eating rats and insects to stay alive. Tragically, two of the crew members succumbed to diseases, and another was killed by gunfire. After enduring four and a half years of captivity, the pirates eventually settled for a considerably reduced sum of money, leading to the release of the remaining 26 hostages, who were finally able to return to their homes. Their time in captivity lasted a staggering 1,672 days. 4. The High Miko In June 1995, the High Miko, a merchant ship owned by a Singaporean company, set sail from Singapore to Cambodia, carrying valuable cargo, including $2 million worth of cigarettes and other goods. However, the ship never reached its intended destination. Instead, it encountered a troubling incident when it was intercepted and boarded by what appeared to be a China Coast Guard cutter. Subsequently, the ship was compelled to sail thousands of kilometers through international waters until it reached southern China. Upon arrival, the ship was seized, and its cargo was sold. However, the details of who conducted the sale and where the money went remained unclear. China denied any responsibility or knowledge of the incident, despite facing accusations of piracy on multiple occasions in the past. Interestingly, the distressed ship even issued a distress call, claiming to have been attacked by pirates, but no assistance came their way. This incident highlights how modern piracy often involves a certain degree of complicity from local governments and authorities, as demonstrated in the case of the High Miko. 5. Area Inc. The Area Inc., an Australian freighter, was chartered by a Chinese company in 1990. However, communication was lost between the owner and the company and the ship's crew within a few months, leading to suspicions that the vessel had been seized by pirates. Subsequently, it was revealed that the ship underwent a transformation into a phantom ship through various underground connections. It acquired a new name and likely fake documentation, enabling it to be used for legal shipping despite being illegally obtained. Pirates often capture ships for such purposes, knowing that naval forces typically refrain from extensive efforts to recapture these vessels. The enigmatic tale of the Area Ing took a grim turn in 1992 when it was purchased as scrap by its new owner. During the process, workers made a chilling discovery. Ten burned bodies were found in an unused freezer. The identities of the victims and the circumstances surrounding their deaths remain unclear, but there is a strong possibility of pirate involvement. This shocking finding aboard the stolen area Ing serves as a haunting reminder of the persistent dangers that lurk on the high seas. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it please like and subscribe so you don't miss out on future uploads. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.